Hey guys, so we're at the planetarium. I think the last time I came here was probably seven years ago. And fun fact, when I came here the last time, I also had my hair short. So, kind of a coincidence. Anyway, um, let's go check the place out. We're entering the anti-gravity room. Ooh, my gosh. <laughs> I already feel disoriented like and I haven't even gone inside yet. It's it's like slanted, so you feel kind of like out of balance. Yeah, it's optical illusion. Really? I, I feel dizzy. It's like this, eh? Huh? So that's why it's like you get disoriented because for me it's like. So this room is really like. It, yeah, it really. It really confuses you. I'm trying to like stand because it's slanting, right? So I'm trying to stand like this, and then like if I try to stand straight. I, 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 I automatically like fall over to, to this side when it's slanting. No, so. <laughs> this is interesting. So I'm standing in the corner now. You're weird. <laughs> you might fall <laughs> You might fall down, eh? A year. One or two years uh, lifespan in space for this kind of like small satellite micro satellite. <laughs> but I don't think they consider this a micro satellite anymore. We got tickets for a show in the in the theater. Ooh, I almost fell down. <laughs> See, I guess up there. So the show was pretty good, but. Neil and I both felt <laughs> we're old people now, so yeah. How many of you actually remember the periodic table of elements? I learned it in school, but I've uh, given back everything to my chemistry teacher. So here at the planetarium, they have this um, table of elements with the corresponding materials displayed on the inside you can also play some mini quizzes okay let's try this choose the object at the kitchen room which has how do i play this <laughs> never mind
I do some musical accompaniment? <laughs> you know people outside can see you, right?